what viruses can cause viral heart disease people may use the term viral heart disease to describe viral myocarditis this refers to when a viral infection causes inflammation of heart muscle tissue inflammation is the body's natural reaction to an infection or injury to the heart it typically occurs as part of an immune response to help protect the heart however long periods of inflammation can weaken and damage the heart resulting in heart problems there are many possible causes of heart inflammation however viral infections are a common cause of myocarditis when a viral infection causes heart inflammation it is known as viral myocarditis other people may also refer to it as viral heart disease types of viruses myocarditis involves inflammation in the myocardium this is the middle muscular layer of the heart wall in many cases the exact cause of heart inflammation is unknown however viral infections are a common cause of myocarditis according to a 2022 review some of the most common viruses that cause viral myocarditis include the following SARS CoV-2 SARS CoV-2 is the virus responsible for COVID-19 a 2023 review highlights that in the united states covid-19 was associated with a significant increase in myocarditis although rare there are also reports of people experiencing myocarditis after receiving their covid-19 vaccination while more research is necessary evidence suggests that SARS CoV-2 may trigger an autoimmune response that results in heart inflammation HIV HIV is a virus that targets and weakens the immune system this virus attacks white blood cells which reduces the body's ability to fight other infections and diseases evidence suggests that roughly one third of people with an hiv infection may experience myocarditis this may be directly due to hiv or due to opportunistic infections a 2017 review suggests that hiv associated myocarditis is common and can lead to hiv associated heart failure parvovirus b19 Parvovirus B19 is a virus that can cause a variety of symptoms. A common presentation of parvovirus B19 infection is known as fifth disease or erythema infectiosum. It is also known as slabbed cheek syndrome. Due to the distinct bright red rash that may occur on one or both cheeks. A 2022 systematic review and meta-analysis notes a significant relationship between parvovirus B19 infection and myocarditis. A 2022 literature review highlights that parvovirus B19 induced myocarditis can be fatal in children. Human herpes virus 6 or hhv6 hhv6 refers to a set of herpes viruses known as hhv 6a and hhv 6b evidence suggests that roughly 95% of adults worldwide are positive for at least one variant of hhv6 this virus can result in a rosella rash Research notes that health experts are recognizing HHV-6 as a common cause of myocarditis. Hepatitis C virus or HCV. HCV can result in hepatitis C. This liver disease is a common blood-borne viral infection that can be can lead to cirrhosis, liver failure and liver cancer. A 2021 review notes that 
HCV can also lead to many different heart problems including myocarditis. Influenza. Influenza or flu is a common res respiratory illness that results from a viral infection. There are four types of flu virus with the two most common types being influenza A and influenza B. Evidence indicates that influenza can result in viral myocarditis. A 2022 literature review suggests that influenza A is more commonly associated with heart problems such as myocarditis. Causes Viruses are one of the most common causes of heart inflammation. When an infection leads to myocarditis, health experts refer to it as infective myocarditis. Myocarditis can occur if the virus infects heart tissue. This can trigger an immune system reaction that may result in inflammation of heart muscle tissue. The immune system has many different defense mechanisms it can use to fight off viruses. Many of these mechanisms can result in inflammation. For example, when an infection causes tissue damage, the body stimulates a response to help heal these tissues. This signals activate certain immune cells that circulate to the site of the damage. These cells can induce an inflammatory response. This inflammation aims to help remove the virus and initial, initiate healing. However, inflammation can remain after resolving the viral infection, which can put stress on the heart. When inflammation of the heart muscle affects its function, health experts refer to it as inflammatory cardiomyopathy. Additionally, the viral infection itself can also damage heart tissue. If the virus is able to replicate and the immune system cannot clear the infection, it can lead to the death of heart muscle cells. Factors that may increase the risk of myocarditis can include age. With myocarditis occurring more often in young adults, sex, as myocarditis is more common in males, genetics and a family history of heart problems, consumption of too much alcohol, recreational drug use, certain medical conditions such as HIV and diabetes, certain medications such as immunosuppressants. Symptoms it can be difficult to identify myocarditis due to a lack of specific symptoms. In fact, many people with myocarditis may not notice any symptoms. Possible symptoms of myocarditis can include but are not limited to chest pain or discomfort such as a feeling of tightness in the chest, shortness of breath, fatigue, heart palpitations or an irregular heartbeat, lightheadedness or fainting, flu-like symptoms such as a high temperature, headaches, body aches, joint pain or sore throat, swelling in the hands, legs, ankles or feet. Some people report that myocarditis can feel similar to a heart attack. If a person experiences any unexplained chest pain or shortness of breath, it is best to seek immediate medical help. Treatment options. At present, there is no specific or effective treatment for viral myocarditis. Initial treatment options are supportive and aim to preserve heart functioning. For example, healthcare professionals will treat high blood pressure, irregular heart rhythm, or heart failure. A doctor may also recommend intravenous immunoglobulin or IVIG. This therapy involves inf infusing, infusing a person with antibodies to help control the body's immune and inflammatory response. However, more research is necessary to determine whether this treatment is effective.
after the infection resolves a doctor may also consider surgery options may include an implantable cardio cardioverter defibrillator or pacemaker these devices can help control irregular heartbeats or other heart rhythm problems in some cases a heart transplant may be necessary to treat heart failure that does not respond to other treatments to try to prevent viral myocarditis health experts recommend practicing good hygiene such as washing hands often additionally they recommend receiving vaccinations to reduce the risk of viral infections